Colorful kites fill the National Mall sky as part of the National Cherry Blossom Festival celebration. The network's Daniela Jaramillo from our D.C. Bureau was in Washington this morning. A little cold and breezy weather didn't stop crowds to gather in D.C. to fly their kites at the Blossom Kite Festival after being canceled two years in a row as a COVID-19 safety measure. In the spirit of just giving here in D.C., we were watching my oldest daughter play with her kite because she made it at school. So we went around to see if we could purchase one. There weren't any to purchase. Well, a, a very kind family came up to us and said, hey, if you want a kite, someone gave us this kite to play with and you can play with it too as long as you pay it forward. Well, it's, it's really exciting and there's so much people and every different colors and skins and there's so many inventive kites that are designed to fly high or just do tricks. One of the things that I think is really beautiful in addition to the kites and the weather and the blossoms is the diversity of people. There are so many different shapes, sizes, colors, ages, you know, everything. So that's beautiful. People enjoyed viewing the kites while sitting by the cherry blossoms and of course, this was a great opportunity for food trucks and vendors to sell to the hundreds of people the welcome spring in the capital. The Blossom Kite Festival is one of D.C.'s long-standing traditions. The National Cherry Blossom Festival is offering virtual workshops to learn how to make and fly kites. Daniela Jaramillo, South Florida Media Network.